What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Your boy Johnny coming at you with uh, about six TTM returns. Guys, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Uh, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and enjoy the fun. Guys, TTM stand for through the mail. I send out bunches of requests out to athletes and report multiple times to this channel a week and let you guys know who's signing, um, if there's a fee, and um, how, how long it took. I'm baseball heavy, but I send out to bunches of athletes. I get a lot of ideas from your videos. So, guys, sit right back. If you dig autographs, sports cards, and you got it, good vibes. Hit that like button down there and share the wealth. Let's get started, guys. I get all my addresses through sportscollectors.net. It has a free option and a $15 a year uh, fee that... Uh, hooks you up with everything you need to know with the TTM game. So I suggest you start there. Let's get started, guys. First one uh, coming looks like out of Salt Lake City. Oh, uh, there you go. You know who it is, Mr. Vern Law. Vern Law, if you guys are TTMers, you know he is the man, the legend. Um, I He's a $7 fee. I always send him $10 a card. It's just because he hooks the cards up, and he's still signing in his 90s. Took 12 days, two of one success. Always, always excited to get Mr. Vern Law. My gosh, guys, if you're new to TTMing, Vern Law should be one of the first ones. He's not going to be with us much longer, and he knows what he's doing. Oh, this got a little bent there a little bit, but that's okay. Got a 1961, um, or is that a 1960? I just took a blank there. Anyways, Vern Law, and look what he does, guys. He hooks it up, puts his autograph. He puts all his, uh, lots of different stats. Comeback Rookie of the Year, 1965. Of course, he was a World Series champ. He's been an all-star, but he always hooks the cards up. He always sends an index card. Check out that index card. His writing is unbelievable, and he doesn't have to do that. So, Mr. Vern Law, you, sir, are the man. And on my note, I asked him who, um, you know, what was one of his favorite memories. He's had a lot of them. He put, um, being the starter of the 1960 World Series against the New York Yankees. Let's go, Vern Law never disappoints. Thank you, sir. Like I said, he's a $7 fee. I always send $10 because it's a no-brainer. Here's another classic. Another classic, guys. Hall of Famer coming out of Baltimore. Can you know who it is? Two a two success. He's a $10 fee. I sent two. Only took eight days. Used to send him quite a bit. He broke his arm. I. It must be at least almost a year since I've sent to him. I've seen you guys sending... Um, Getting him back, so I could not resist. Got two of two, like I said, Mr. Brooks Robinson. Check it out on my Sporting News card. Blue ink, love that card, and check it out. Had sent some vintage, had to send a little new stuff, so check that out. I think that's a 2022 Stadium Club. Stadium Club is known for their pictures, and boy, Mr. Brooks Robinson no, not smearing, doing it right. Thank you, Mr. Brooks Robinson, sir, for your autograph. That Those never get old in my book. Um, I asked him a question, too. I um, asked him um, who was some of his um, sports inspirations. And he put Stan the Man Musial, Al Kaline, and Bill Pickney, which was in the Farm League, um, Farm League. So, even answered a question. What a class act. Thank you, sir. Man, that's so cool. All right, let's see. Next one, coming out of Tampa, Tampa, Florida. Three to three, zero feet in 185 days. A little longer than we want to see, but we're glad that it came back. Nonetheless, Mr. Dave LaPointe. Table of Point gave us some blue ink here on our 1985 tops. Playing for the Cardinals there. 1983 tops. And then the White Sox, and I believe that's an 88 score. Three for three. 
Um, he's been a good signer for me. Usually takes a little bit longer than lately, than normal, but that is okay. Like I said, these guys have lives, and the fact that they send them back is amazing to me. So, Mr. Dave LaPointe, thank you, sir, for your autograph. All right, guys, next one, North Houston, Texas. We got a 5-3 of three success here. Two days, zero fee. Oh, yeah, we got some vintage going to Johnny from Bob Aspermonte. Him and his kin, his brother Ken, number 14, have been great signers. A lot of times they send their extra cards. Um, he even signed an index card to Johnny, Bob Aspermonte, number 14. So that's two autographs. And then the two cards I sent needed the 1961 rookie card. And look at that blue ink auto. Great placement. What a good-looking card with auto. Then he also, wow, got a 1967. What's a 65? That's a 67. Um, very nice. Man, he's got a great-looking autograph. Bob Aspermonte, sir, thank you for your autograph. We're going to put the rookie up there. We'll put Dave LaPointe down there. we got to put a little more... I love, I'm more of a vintage guy. I collected, you know, in the late 80s, mid, uh, early 90s. Those cards are definitely nostalgic for me. But since getting into TTMing, man, I'm all about some vintage. Uh, Philadelphia, PA, we got a 2-2 two two success. Uh, nine days. This guy is a zero fee, but I always throw five bucks in because I love his cards. He's a vintage gentleman that always signs for me. And he never disappoints. Mr. Bobby Chance. Check it out. Bobby Chance on a 1955 Bowman. Blue Ink Auto. 1952 uh, AL MVP inscribed. And then I also found this with his brother that's passed away, Bill Chance. He signed that one as well. Man, I love the vintage coming in. That 1955 Bowman is pretty sweet. We're going to put both of these up just because they're 55 Bowmans. <laughs> All right. Let's not cover the goodness up. And then he also kind of answered a question for me. I asked him, uh, who did him and his brother, um, who was his inspirations? And he put all ball players. Can't really read it there, but it says all ball players. So respect to Mr. Bobby Shantz. All right, guys, we got our last one coming out of uh, Tulsa, Oklahoma. Let me know what you think about the returns. We got some great ones. We got some great vintage today, guys. Uh, like I said, Oklahoma, we have a 4-4 success, zero feet in 11 days. It's about that time for some Johnny Ray. Got him on my 19, uh, what is this, 80... 87 Fleer Award winners. Got a couple of these award winners signed by some other players. So I thought Johnny Ray, that blue ink, kind of looks good on that yellow. We got an uh, 90, an 88 Tops. We got an 83 Donruss. We got an 86 Fleer. So 4-4. Four, four. Johnny Ray does not disappoint it either. So we're going to put that 83 up there. And share the wealth. Guys, what do you think about the haul? Man, we got some Brooks Robinson. We got some Vern Laws. We got some Bobby Shantz. Aspermonte. Good luck picking some good, uh, your favorite. Guys, be good to each other. Let me know in the comments what you think. Hope I gave you some ideas. Um, Johnny out. Let's go.